Well, welcome to another game. We are playing a team with a checkerboard pattern with yellow and green. So it's very similar to our colors, but I think you can tell the difference. So enjoy the game, hit that like button, make sure to subscribe. All right, not a good way to start the game. The reason I went in is because I went down before the shot. I was assuming he had nothing but to shoot and then he passed it. So when I went down, I was sliding and I wasn't able to reposition to get over. So what you want to do on shots like that is just shuffle with the player. Don't go down too early and stay with them. Make sure you stay square because if they pass it, then you could just explode to get over. I'm gonna stay in front, in front boys, in front, in front. So on that shot there, I didn't really see at all the release. I just knew it went to the player and I heard the shot and I went down. It hit off my, my uh, arm, but I guess I wasn't square enough because I had no idea where the puck was coming from. What you could do a little bit differently there is try to get a little bit more depth, but do your best to try to see around the player so you can get square. You got 10 seconds, man on though. Keep it up, boys. So the reason that this went in was because I used the split rather than a power push to try to make the save. So if you're in this situation with a guy back door, make sure you get ready for that pass. And when it happens, you want to try to explode using the opposite leg and push as hard as you can to get over to cover as much net as possible. That's not what my team needs right now. I need to stop everything. On that goal there, I think I was just too distracted by the stick handling. I was waiting for a move. He shot it half-assed and then uh, it just went in literally below my glove. I didn't even, I kind of got frozen there. You just gotta be prepared to go down, make, make the save at all times. Move him, move him. Guys, in front here, in front. Guys, he's open in front. Why? Not much I could do on that one. Try my best to get over with my stick. It's not much you could do in those situations. Let's hope they don't happen anymore. Why is it four on one? From a technical perspective, yes, I could have got my pad down maybe a little faster, but it's just hard when you're going back and forth, back and forth. That's no excuse. But you got four on two, which it looked like four on one for a bit. There's just so many options that you have to be prepared for the pass. But when it's like two passes, then you're just kind of out of position no matter what you do. You just gotta try your best to get over. 
in front. You're good, you're good, face. Thank you, thank you. Man on, man on, man on. So in a goal like that, I can feel myself being a little fatigued. And so what happened was the guy had it all the way at the red line and I was like, he has nothing to do, so I'm gonna go down. But because there's like two guys open in front, he just passed it to one of them and he just lobbed it in the net. So you gotta just stay on your feet as long as possible. Well, this is not the best game uh, to play right after going to a goalie camp, but just lots more to work on. That's all it is. A lot to work on. Yeah. There's definitely a lot of fatigue here at the end of the game. Now, obviously, we are getting outplayed a lot, but it all comes down to skating. I don't think it went in. No, it didn't. <laughs> no, no. He stopped it. Okay. He stopped it, yeah. Good job, boys. Well, at least it wasn't nine, right? <laughs> good game. Good game. Yeah, good game. 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 All right, that's not how I wanted to come back and play, but they're definitely a good team. They had a lot of odd man rushes, odd man goals, screens. They were all over the place. So tough game, tough loss, but it was still fun. Hit that like button, make sure to subscribe, and I'll see you guys next week. Bye.